Dear students, as you know, the challenges of life do not have a timetable. As a result, it is impossible to adequately prepare in advance for every life challenge. We are in the middle of a worldwide pandemic COVID-19, accompanied by disruption of our normal mode of life including instruction and learning. Course and Module Outcomes, Unchanged C Revised Syllabus Assessments, 1. Exam 3 and the final exam will take place online in Blackboard through ProctorU. You need to go ahead and create a ProctorU account and watch the orientation videos for test takers in the Resource Center HTTPS www.proctoru.com slash Live Resource Dash Center Closing Round Bracket Dot Instruction regarding proctored examination is found in the Proctor Guidelines Forms module which is located above the Week 1 module. 2. In-class exercises will continue as bonus points to your exam score. The major change is to be renamed as AI Project CH since we no longer have face-to-face -face classes and as summarized in the initial course assessment. Also available in Blackboard. Three, presentations will be done remotely through Zoom screen share as well as posted as a YouTube video clip in the weekly module. Three, types of exam three and final exam will be multiple choice questions instead of problem solving or fill in blank questions. This change is due to low scores of students when they were problem solving questions. Four, course materials, unchanged same textbook. Four, course technologies, we will use Zoom to meet virtually. Prior to the COVID-19 pandemic, we had in-class face-to-face class session on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Our new virtual meeting room is HTTPS, Zuma slash my slash physics without tears. We will use this link each time we have an online class session. The meeting ID is 457,705,154 in case you are joining from your browser. Grades will be updated at the end of every week in Blackboard. Five, virtual class meetings and office hours. Since class members are in different time zones, I will give flexibility of either synchronously or asynchronously in participating in the web. Five, virtual class meetings and office hours. Since class members are in different time zones, I will give flexibility of either synchronously or asynchronously in participating in the webinar. The weekly meeting will be recorded and posted in the weekly module in BB. While I will miss the face-to-face -face meetings, I encourage you to take advantage of the flexibility that comes with online course delivery and learning including 24-7 access to course materials, ability to rewind and review the recorded virtual sessions, studying during your most productive time, one-on-one -on -one virtual meetings with instructor, no need to physically come to one geographic location. However, I must warn you that studying remotely requires more self-discipline and time management as you may be tempted to think that you have more time resulting in procrastination. 
You must deliberately set aside chunks of time each day slash week to complete your course activities. Do not wait till the last minute. I looking forward to helping you learn economics remotely beginning March 24, 2020. All the best, Dr. Sun.